setting a car up to do parasitic draw using an amp meter, using the battery pack to go to the positive of the alternator back, which is a big wire and the ground and the motor. If this has a light on it or a switch, and boy, this thing is beat up. Okay, show off in the middle, please. We're gonna switch it to off when we have our meter hooked up. So right now, switch it to on. So now this is an auxiliary power. We need to take the cable up. We need to get the meter in series. Let's go. Cable up. You gotta, oh. Remember, our, our battery pack is on. We're to the positive post. We're to the negative on the engine. This way, relays that are sticking are not going to be a problem. We're all good, right? Yep. Right? <laughs> all right, so we're going to pull the cable up. And Mike number two over there is getting his meter hooked up. What do you got the leads on, Mike? got it on the amp jack, you got it on amps, and we got it in common. And we should use our fuse, our 10 amp, get it out of your pocket. <laughs> Why? Because if we pull over 10 amps, Blow we're going to have a problem. Up. We're using a circuit breaker. That's so he's going to hook that to the cable, right? And, then, yep. and he's going to take the meter, hold it to the post, put your meter down there. Okay, and now when we switch the power off here, all current is going to flow through there. We didn't lose anything. So if we have this on, and watch this, take that meter off for a second. I'm going to go show you when I open the door up, we got a light on. See the light? Light's on. If we didn't have this on, we wouldn't have that, right? Correct. Now we put our meter in series again. We check our amperage, which is going to be up until all the lights in the car go off. Usually going to take 20, 30 seconds. This one will sleep now. So look, still timing out, timing out, timing out. Until it gets down. Now we're starting to drop. Down to 900 milliamps. Or 980, 970. Eight something, seven, then it gets to a point where it drops like a rock. These are all the things going to sleep. Four something, taking a lot longer than I thought. <laughs> Maybe because of the charger giving, uh... let's see. Well, I'm gonna move this Can I take away. that off for a second? Nope. 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 So just something staying on a little longer. Yeah. But we got the idea of someone open the door up. The pack is off. Maybe the GDI injector. Yeah. Yeah. Look at the amperage. You see how we went for well, four amps? Yeah. 500 and something milliamps, but now we're going to start dropping. So we didn't lose anything. This is what you want. The battery pack to either the back of the alternator or you kind of hook it up some way down to the big cable that keeps everything alive. Then you shut it off, right? All right, that's how you're done. And if when you remove it, you don't want to lose anything, you would turn this on, disconnect, and now put wow. the cable back on, and you would not lose anything. 